Hello students. Welcome to Mary Secondary, West Covina Learning Center. My name is Alex Carrillo and I will be your personal instructor for your education at Mary Secondary. To accompany me will be classroom assistant Alicia Malaki and resource specialist Elizabeth Fernandez. My direct line of contact is 626-962-7425. Fax number is 626-962-7534. My work email address is acarrillo at altus-maris-mirus.net. The hours of operation are Monday through Friday from 7.30 a.m to 3.30 p.m. Students' appointment days are Monday and Wednesday for each week. Students may attend Tuesday and Thursday by appointment only. Classroom schedule and time are subject to change. The campus is located at 330 South California Avenue, next to School First Credit Union and Weight Watchers. The campus is outside the West Covina Mall. Here at Maris, majority of courses are offered in a blended format of traditional textbook and online content. Today I'll be discussing the steps needed to log in into your virtual classroom, a short tutorial on how to use it properly, and the expectations of student engagement. First, you want to put your resource card in front of you for assistance. If you do not have a resource card or have lost or misplaced it, please contact your instructor immediately. The first login refers to Naviance. Naviance is used to gather information pertaining to your personality, career options, and college information. The second login refers to the discussion for today. The login should be titled School Pathways Parents. The second login is what we'll be discussing today. The login should be titled School Pathways Parent Students Portal Login. You should be able to view the website address, username, and password given to you from your instructor. Once you have typed in the web address, please hover the mouse over the blue parent student tab located in the top right hand corner. Once hovering, scroll down to student portal and left click on the mouse. Next, type in your username and password and click login. Once you're logged in, click on Ingenuity, which is located in the top left-hand side. Next, drag your mouse to the top right-hand corner of the screen and click on your online course title. Once done, you'll be transferred to your online course. The first step is to complete is the student orientation video. 
After the video is completed, navigate with your newfound knowledge and start your online course. It is recommended that each student spends a minimum of four hours per day of being actively engaged on their online coursework. If you have any questions on your online course, please do not hesitate to contact your instructor.